On April 19th in 2022, the European Central Bank just published a 104-page document stating that the Trans-European Automatic Real-Time Growth Settlement Express Transfer System, which is short for TARGET, will be implemented as soon as possible. And if you go to page 87, you can see that they even have a fee structure on how they can monetize this. Now, just to be honest, I didn't read the 104 pages. I mean, it's 104 pages, okay? But the crypto YouTuber Lewis Jackson, who is very good looking, okay? That's him, and he's very good looking. And he said that what the European Central Bank is trying to do with Target is pretty much the exact thing that Ripple is trying to do, which is trying to provide liquidity for all the banks sending money across anywhere. Now, what if Ripple comes in and provide the European banks with a better, faster, and a cheaper way to provide liquidity for all the European banks? How much would Ripple make from all of that? Well, to calculate that is pretty easy. If you have the fees associated with providing liquidity, which is actually right here, right? it's actually in the paper. And if we look at the largest fee, we can see that it would cost 200 thousand euros to transfer 500 billion euros per day or more so if you transfer more than 500 billion euros a day it would still cost two hundred thousand dollars a year now if you want to convert that to us dollars it it would still be the same right? it would still cost you two hundred thousand dollars to transfer 500 billion dollars or more per day so now for the calculations. But before we continue, if you guys can just hit the subscribe button, eh, I would very, very much appreciate it. And to show my appreciation, uh, I'll tell you guys something that I just found out after living on this earth for 33 years. And that is, girls wipe their butts from the front to the back. As a guy, I never really thought about it. I just wiped my butt from the back to the front because... It's just a lot easier to go there and wipe. But the girls, they wipe from the front to the back to avoid contamination with their genitals. Oh my goodness. Am I the only one who didn't know this after 33 years? All right, now I'm back to the video. If we search the internet to see how much money is actually transferred per day, we will find that it is around $5 trillion per day. Okay? That is quite a lot of money. So let's say that we want to transfer $5 trillion per day. If we take that, multiply it by 365 days per year, and then we multiply that by $200,000 for every $500 billion transferred, then that would give us an annual fee of $730 million a year in fees. And just to be clear, in this calculation, I am charging $200,000 for every $500 billion that's being transferred. The document said that it would still cost $200,000 to transfer more than $500 billion a day, but I'm going to go with a very bare minimum and charge every $500 billion $200,000 in fees. So and that means that if XRP provides the liquidity for all the money that's being transferred in the world, then in a whole year, and they would make around $730 million in fees. All right, guys. Well, and that's all that I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching and see you guys next time. Bye.